Hello everybody and welcome to another video update. Now this is to do with my let's play of Kaiserreich for Darkest Hour which those of you that have been around for a long time and those of you that follow me on Twitter will already know what's going on but I wanted to give a concrete explanation. That and I have some more information now than I did back when I put this let's play on hold. So this game has been on hold for a very long time. In fact, I think I put it on hold sometime around mid-September of last year, which means it's been on hold for roughly six months. And that's me ballparking it because I am terrible at doing math in my head. But anyways, at the time I put it on hold because whenever I would try to open that game, it would work fine for a little bit, and what would happen then is after being on the loading screen you get at the beginning for a couple of seconds, I would get the sound cutting out, and then a message popped up that told me that Darkest Hour had stopped responding, and then the game would crash. So, I could not play Darkest Hour, and for the longest time, I did a bunch of research and stuff, and my initial thought was that the reason it was being like this was because the game had been updated recently, and probably some file or other hadn't downloaded properly, or it was incompatible with Windows 10, both of which were options as far as I was concerned. Windows 10's updates have been a little weird lately, but I recently found out that that wasn't actually the case, and the thing that was going on that was actually causing all of this is that the version of Darkest Hour, the latest one, is incompatible with AMD drivers. <clears throat> the really new ones, I mean, because at the moment, any AMD drivers newer than 16 point something, 16.1.7.2, I think, are incompatible with Darkest Hour and will cause it to crash. So the only option would be to downgrade my driver like eight or nine versions or something, and I am not doing that. So what I'm basically saying is that Unless there's some magic solution that can cause Darkest Hour to become compatible with AMD's latest drivers again, then we're either going to have to wait on me doing this Let's Play until AMD updates their drivers so they work with Darkest Hour, or until Darkest Hour is updated to work with modern AMD drivers. So unless there's a patch, those are the options. Just wait. Sorry, I know this is really bad news, but I felt like people deserve to know, especially since there were quite a few viewers who watched my introduction video and were no doubt looking forward to this, and I wanted you to be aware of what was going on. So, thank you for watching, and I will catch you next time.